In a dramatic report, the UN's Intergovernmental Panel says the world is nowhere near its target of keeping the rise in average global temperatures to 1.5 degrees Celsius. Every year there's been a beginning, but never a middle or an end to this story. Instead, it says we're heading for an increase of three degrees from pre-industrial levels. Protesters have blocked off five major bridges in central London, demanding that the UK government takes greater action on climate change. We have come here to let you know that change is coming, whether you like it or not. Environmental activists cause disruption in a number of areas of central London with the group Extinction Rebellion. Demanding action on climate change, thousands gathered at five central locations some gluing themselves to roads and offices. Overall, the protests were peaceful. This house must declare an environment and climate emergency. Parts of London were brought to a standstill today by climate change protesters at the start of what's set to be a two-week demonstration, calling on governments to act now to avert what they say is a climate emergency. Extinction Rebellion got the government to declare a climate emergency. Okay, This time they're asking what it intends to do about it. It's a pretty reasonable question. Thousands of Extinction Rebellion protesters have descended on Parliament Square in central London to kick off 10 days of civil disobedience. But the Prime Minister has condemned environmental activists for preventing the delivery of millions of newspapers this morning. Extinction Rebellion activists have smashed windows at HSBC's headquarters in East London. One, two, An extreme heat wave is sweeping across Western Canada. More than 120 people have died after the worst flooding in parts of Western Europe for several decades. Russia's forests are burning and they're burning on permafrost. Severe flash flooding has battered parts of London as thunderstorms swept where large swathes of non-profits are underwater. Weather forecasters say it is the heaviest downpour in 1,000 years. <laughs> Shut up, Zach. Shut up, Zach.